let's take a look at how to continuously talk to your Echo device. Stay tuned. What's going on guys? Welcome to Dial Home Tech. And in this video, we're gonna be taking a look at how to continuously talk to your Echo device. If you've watched the latest video where Brett and I got together to do a comparison between the Google Mini and the Echo Dot with Clock, you would see that one of my wish lists on that video was that you could talk to your Echo device without having to keep saying the wake word. Well, it turns out that you can. Somebody pointed it out in the comments, so I went back, did a little research, and yeah, sure enough, you can actually do that. And that's something I've been wanting for a very long time. Because, I mean, who doesn't want to just sit there and talk to their assistant for a long time without having to keep saying wake words over and over again? I mean, we all want to do that. Talk to them for, like, hours. Right? I mean... Right? I mean, I was asking for a friend because he wants to do that, but anyways, um, yeah. So in order to set the follow-up mode, all you have to do is just go to your Amazon Alexa app and then select devices and then Echo and Alexa and select which device you actually want to access it in order to do that. So in this case, we're going to pick the Echo Dot and then you can come down here and look for a follow-up mode and it's right there so tap on it and then it's going to give you a little toggle where you can turn it on or off and all that's going to do really it's going to make sure that every time you fire a direction or, or a command it's going to stay listening for another five seconds but it's going to keep a little bit of a cache of what you previously said so that it knows it to refer to um, if you make a follow-up question to it. All right, let's see how this works. Alexa, when was the movie Avatar released? The film Avatar, the movie, was released about 10 years ago on December 18, 2009. How much did it make on the box office? Avatar grossed 761 million US dollars in the United States and 2 billion 790 million US dollars worldwide. Did that answer your question? Yes. Thanks for your feedback. So you see, um, you can actually use the continuous conversation to just keep asking questions um, regarding the subject that you're talking about. So you don't have to actually say your wake word again and then bring up the subject again using the same thing that you asked before. You can do that when controlling your smart devices as well. So I'll show you how. Alexa, turn the office light on. Turn the office light off. Play Sticky Stuff by Avocado Junkie on Diego's Echo 5. Sticky Stuff by Avocado Junkie playing on Diego's Echo 5 on Amazon Music. There you go. So this may be a small tip, but it's definitely a nice quality of life addition to your Echo devices. If you haven't yet, make sure you click on this link right here and that will take you to the comparison that we did of the Google Nest Mini as well as the Echo Dot with Clock. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to give me your thumbs up and also consider subscribing to the channel where we talk about home automation, smart home technology and tech reviews as well. As always, you can check me out on social media at @dialhometech. Thank you so much for watching and until next time, I'm Dial. See ya.